Well, it's a pathway really. Um, they start off at this junior level. Hopefully, with the coaching we can give them, they get into the home international team, and that's therefore is a stepping stone to the into the world junior team. And from there, once they get up to 17, they're going to the youth team, and eventually, hopefully, into the main senior world team. Um, matter of interest, the the junior home team and youth home team, which have just won gold medals in the home internationals, both have come through this talent pathway. So it, it does actually work. I'm Chris Clark and I'm the lead coach of the Angling Trust Julian Junior Talent Pathway for the two days down here at Livington. Uh, I'm David Graham, I'm a junior world team manager and junior team selector for the, the national teams. We actually time people from when the, the rig hits the beach to when the rig hits, hits the water. We did this in some, in some senior trials with Ben and it ranged from 12 seconds to a minute. If you multiply a minute by 20 casts in a day, that's 20 minutes, your bait's on the beach doing nothing. Speed is very, very important, changing over your rig and so forth. Very, very important. Speed and efficiency, the two of them go together. For me personally, nothing more satisfying than having uh, youngsters come through the talent pathway, make their way into the teams, um, work their way through at the junior level. And for, for me as a junior team manager to see a polished angler go into the youth team level and shine, it gives me great pride because of the work I've done with them and the work myself and Chris has put into the team. My name's Braden Older, so I'm 13 and I'm from Ipswich, Suffolk. I've been doing pleasure fishing with my dad for around like five or six years and then started getting into match fishing which he was also doing at the time and then I started to get more involved in it, started getting better and better and then obviously um, starting to move into a bit more competitive sort of England, uh, well the talent pathway then I got chosen for England team. We got gold, got gold from the home nations not too long ago, a few weeks ago. I would recommend um, doing the talent pathway is a really good experience and you get to meet a, a lot of good anglers and there's with a good bunch of people that will really help you and get you involved in match angling and get you really improve your skills in fishing. Having a support of parents just means a lot and um, they can also help your skills and help you gain confidence with other people as well. What I'd like to do in the future is, again, uh, stay in the team and go on to hopefully win more further medals and then uh, keep like going up in England into the youths and then the men's and hopefully carry on doing well and getting gold. A lot of people have the basics of fishing, but it's the little things which we teach them, the little things they probably wouldn't even think about and they are those little things all out there making a very very efficient angler at the end of the day and that's what we're trying to install in them these little tiny little bits and pieces which a lot of people wouldn't wouldn't even think about no um a team player is really important and a personality that fits in with a group is 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 very important uh, we, what we don't want is is a group of five individuals who are very individual um, Fishing can be quite secretive because you don't want to be giving away your top secrets, the things that you do that make your results so good and so easy. But what you've got to do is get that group together and, and get them to share um, that wealth of knowledge. And when somebody's had a really good match that day, tell all the rest of the team exactly why. We have a meeting at the end and have a breakdown. So they've got to be good communicators. They've got to be good personalities. They've got to be able to share. Um, I think, uh, as Chris has said, 
being a really, really good angler is a very important thing, but a lot of that we can teach and we can coach. If you get the right blend of youngsters together, uh, we can be absolutely phenomenal, can't we? Yes, yeah, absolutely. It's a winning combination. Absolutely this game. phenomenal. So, yes. Yeah. It's something which we said it right at the very beginning of today when they're introducing themselves as the youngsters. It's the communication between them which is so, so important in any winning team. Yeah. If you get them communicating, that's half the problem solved. Is it, they will then solve the problem because they're talking with each other. True, very true. Talent Pathway is open to everybody in the country. Nobody should feel bad. We want to see as many young anglers from all over the country, all corners of the country, come and compete. Yes, it would be lovely if we could go to them, but unless we get the funds, we can't go to them. Um, so unfortunately, they're going to have to come to us at the moment. But that's my, that will be my love, to have youngsters, more youngsters coming from all over the country, feeding in, so we, we would then have world beating teams. Nobody would be able to touch us. That I'm quite certain. Yeah. Well, from a, from a manager of the world team's point of view, I can wholeheartedly endorse what Chris is saying because ultimately then my team will be stronger and better. Uh, the results will be easy to come by and we'll come back with more medals. So um, yeah, to, to, to see uh, anglers from, from all the corners of this country uh, coming to an event like this would be absolutely fantastic. Um, yeah, publicising what we do would be, would be, yeah, see if we can get some more people down, that would be fantastic.